guys, it's Greta here, Mindset and Business Coach. And today's topic for you is how to find your passion. And most importantly, how to know are you on the right path with your passion. So what happens to my friends a lot and with people I know, a lot of them are really passionate and we want to find what we are meant to do in life. Try this, we try that, and they give up after, let's say, three months. Some people even invest in their passion uh, for a year, and when we wear themselves out, we see that it's not really working, we start losing hope, we get insecure, we lose a bit of self-esteem, and it just doesn't work. And the next thing, what happens really scary is we actually get fearful to try again. So what I want to talk about is it's so important to find the correct passion in life and how to know how you actually found the correct passion in life for you. Because we are all very different. Just because I am a coach, it doesn't mean that you meant to be a coach. You know, like we are all very different. So you need to find what really clicks and resonates with you. So recently I was coming across numerology where I got my aha moment because I've been doing my passion now for nearly four years, every single day. I live and breathe it and I love it. Yes, I do get tired. Yes, I do get exhausted. But as soon as I get my energy back, the first thing I do is focus on my stuff, focus on my business, focus on my clients, focus on my passion. I am obsessed with it. Now, how come I am so obsessed with it? And how come I get the energy to continue to be so obsessed? Well, ladies, I actually tried numerology today. The way numerology works, it tells you your number for your life path and it tells you your number for expression and destiny path. And I remember the first time I used to do numerology as fun, right, when I was a child, basically. And I do know my numbers, but I kind of forgot about them and I totally forgot what we meant. And actually recently I thought, you know, let me just kind of have a look at it again, you know, because I am into spirituality and I love this. It's kind of my thing, right? So I add my life path numbers and I get number four. And how to add your life path numbers, the way you add it, it's for example, I am born 1983 7th of March. So what you do, you add zero plus seven plus uh, zero plus three plus one plus nine plus eight plus three and then you get number 31 and then what you do you add three plus one equals four this is how you get numerology number this is how you get your numerology number. So uh, if it sounds too complicated, don't worry. I'm actually going to put a free link for you guys. If you want to know your life path numerology number, what's your life path, I'll add it totally free. You can type in your date of birth and they will tell you your life number and they will tell you what you are about. And also this is the same way how you find your expression or destiny number. So the way that is calculated, you type in your name and your surname, and then each of the letter has a number. So we will, anyway, we will calculate it for you as well, totally free, and it's really interesting. So then I calculated my number and they got number four, what it meant was, natural leaders we have enormous strength we have enormous discipline we understand how things work we pick themselves up if we fail very quickly now what's really funny i have created my ultimate self-love group where i talk a lot about self-awareness why i am where i am the challenges that i had to go through how i overcome the challenges and in my self-awareness course i talk a lot about 
self-discipline, self-strength, how to go over obstacles, how to stay focused, how to stay determined. The realization now is that it comes very naturally for me to talk about these things and coach these things because this is what my life path number is anyway. This is what I meant to do anyway. What I'm sharing with you is if you think that maybe you have found your life passion or your life goal and you see that you procrastinate, you don't want to do it, you kind of putting it on the side, you know, maybe it's just because it's not your passion, you know, and it's okay if it's not. But what I would recommend is ladies, find out your life path number, find out your uh, destiny number, and then this will give you a bigger self-awareness about who you truly are. Or it will give you an aha moment why your passion or your life goal is not clicking, is not working. Maybe because simply it's not meant to be for you like that. And it's okay. You will just have to look for something that you resonate with smoothly. Because when it's smooth, there is no doubt that it's the right thing for you. But once you start to procrastinating, we have a problem, okay? So guys, if you like my video, please press like. Don't you get my ultimate self-love course? As I said, I nail at coaching discipline. I nail at coaching leadership. I nail at coaching how to go for your dreams, how to pick yourself up from your failures. Why? Because I was meant to coach that. So my ultimate self-love course is really, really good. If you want to learn how to love yourself and become the ultimate best version of you. And to find out more about this ultimate self-love package, I will put the link down in my video description below. Uh, let me know in the comments below what do you think, uh, what is your life path number, what is your destiny number. It would be awesome to know your results. Join my free Facebook group, it's called High Value Mindset. You can follow me on my Instagram, my Instagram is called High Value Mindset as well. For life and business coaching, please get in touch with me through WhatsApp. So thank you so much for watching ladies, kisses from London. Mwah.